Let's say you want to have a zoom on the images for a WooCommerce product. Once you install and activate the VP Image Zoom plugin, you'll find the zoom immediately applied on the product images. Here is a refresh. And here we have the zoom. If you want the zoom on an image in a page or a post, then you need to go edit the post and select the image where you want the zoom and then click on the button in the editor called image zoom and then update the page refresh and check the zoom in the left side menu you'll find an option for vp image zoom and you can choose between several lens types by default, it is set with a zoom window, but you can change it to no lens or round lens or square lens. We can play a bit with the configuration options for the round lens. Um, for example, we can change the border thickness. or maybe increase the lens size. And let's change the fading time to one second, let's say. If you choose to have a zoom window, then you can modify its width and height. You can change the distance to the main image or the border thickness. And the other options, I'll let you discover them by yourself. The zoom will react to the product variation change and will show the appropriate zoomed image. By responsive, it is meant that on a narrow browser, the zoom window will fill only the available space. And if the browser's width is smaller than a certain threshold, then the zoom window switches automatically to inner zoom. You might want to align the zoom window to the left of the main image, depending on your page's design. You can zoom in and out with the help of the mouse wheel. Several well-known light boxes are supported for this feature, including old carousel, pretty photo, or fancy box.